Seriously, on behalf of the Austin Film Society, I want to welcome you to what's sure to be a wonderful night, and I want to thank you for your support. Again, welcome everyone to the ninth annual Texas Film Hall of Fame induction ceremony. I'm so glad to be here. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Brendan Fraser. Thank you for having me here. Thank you, everybody out here, Austin Film Society, everybody in Texas. Pretty cool honor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Here's the thing. This is Texas. It ain't California. It ain't New York. So you guys have fun and... Uh, we don't have to be stuffy around here. You can probably tell from the suit that this is my first time at this event. <laughs> I, I won't make the same mistake again. I am absolutely thrilled to be here and more thrilled to be here honoring Mr. Hagman. Uh, that's the way he likes me to call him. Mr. Hagman, it's never Larry. Uh, you know, this is really, really kind of nice because I, I don't get awards very much. As a matter of fact, I don't think I want any more Awards hardly in, in America, in Germany, in France, and those kind of things. <laughs> really, I'm not kidding you. And this one from, from the heart of Texas is... Right. It's a real honor to be here with uh, the people being honored tonight. I feel just capital. Ah... <laughs> uh, I want to thank you for having me in my home, which is Texas. Uh, Miss Gray. Yes, darling. I want to thank Miss Gray. I've been married to her twice on television. <laughs> Powers Booth is not a good actor. <laughs> Powers Booth is a great actor. It's really strange to think about this because uh, I've been fortunate enough to win some stuff and be nominated for a lot of things in my life, but this one, has a particular meaning to me. And I was watching a documentary a couple months ago about uh, Jonestown, and I thought, uh, this guy's good, but he's no powers booth. <laughs> so I went to architecture school here at the University of Texas, and yeah, they did tell me, like, yay, UT, I loved it. <laughs> 
But at the end, they did kind of say, hey, man, maybe you're a little too, like, creative or maybe they're not going to encourage that kind of thing in architecture. So they sort of planted the seed that maybe I would do something else. There's a whole host of people who never saw Dallas, but almost everybody saw I Dream of G. Yeah. Billy Bob was born in uh, Northeast Texas, Hot Springs, Arkansas. <laughs> I've made these particular films that they talked to you about just now in Texas. And I've lived here uh, about a, you know, close to a third of my life. And my heart's been in Texas forever. My family's from Richardson, Garland, uh, Greenville. And uh, this is where I spent my childhood down here. And uh, everything about this place is everything I ever wanted. It's an artistic place, it's a creative place. Uh, when they say Texas is better, Texas is bigger, I think they're right. Three months into filming Tombstone, my friend Stephen Lang, who played Ike Clanton, said to Powers, he goes, you know, you ought to hang out with Tom, he's kind of funny. Powers goes, we've been shooting this son of a bitch for three months, he hasn't even made me smile. <laughs> I didn't know Thomas Hayden Church was funny. <laughs> In Tombstone, he was just one of my dumbest cowboys. <laughs> I think I just got bitch slapped by Powers Both. <laughs> That's awesome. I don't prepare a lot of speeches because I'm not really very familiar with this medium right here. <sighs> Acceptance, you know. Ex <laughs> Except for AA, <laughs> you know. Uh. I'm just gonna go and fold up catering tables now. Cause nobody can follow Hagman, man! I'd like to uh, thank everybody with the Austin Film Society and uh, guys like uh, Rick Linklater and all the, all the characters who keep this place going. The Texas Filmmakers Production Fund will hit a million dollars in grants this summer to independent and, and, and deserving filmmakers. Without getting mushy, I can't tell you how much this means to me personally. I hope that we bring more movies to Texas. There's a hell of a lot of talent comes out of here, and we all want to work here. Uh, so let's all do it together. I wanted to say God bless you guys, and thank you, and God bless Texas. I feel like I've, I guess I've come a long way, and I thank you guys for honoring me here tonight. And uh, appreciate it. I don't think any state in the union has that many cool people. I'm proud to be a small part of it. And uh, I appreciate the award. I appreciate you having me. And uh, I don't know, let's go play some cards. What do you say? Where the hell did that come from? It just came out of nowhere, I guess. <laughs> Anyhow, you have all these fans here and you're gonna get your money back 100 times over if you start this program. So you representatives and senators and all that out there, go for it. You can't miss. Thank you. All the other great crew members, a lot of them from Texas working again in Houston and uh, just uh, glad to be here tonight and thank you. I'll give this to those guys. We'll see you back here next year. Hopefully we'll see Thomas back next year. Thank you very much. Thank you.